lot. How that's kind of a pet peeve of, of ours. Oh yeah, Jesus died for you. The Son of, of God, um, God died. But, but you, I think we need to start putting a butt behind stuff like, well, yes, there is a moral law, but... Yes, God loves righteousness and demands righteousness, but... Yes, you screwed up and what you deserve based on the law is hell, but... If you're going to pluck verses out of the Bible and build your theology around verses, pluck living life verses. Pluck living life verses and make everything else line up with them. Amen? God is for you. Nothing can separate you from the love of God. No created thing and certainly not something from your own hands. He has decided in advance before He ever created you to love you forever. And you will not manipulate Him by being bad. He loves you. He loves you. He loves you, silly. He loves you. Knowing that He loves you like that, does that, does that fill anyone with a desire to go out and hurt His heart? Amen? let you in on a secret law and grace wanted the same thing law and grace want the same exact thing law and grace are after exactly the same thing law doesn't yield it but grace 